half of 2018, we reached a significant milestone. For the first time in recent history, the number of people in poverty became less and the number of people having middle income or more is now gradually becoming more than the people living in poverty. So, reaching middle income is a very significant place. It's that place where you have a little bit more discretionary income. And usually people then start buying stuff. New clothes, more processed food, go on holidays, buy furniture. Yay, says the marketers, and ah, says the earth. Because at the moment where we are, on a global scale, we are already using up more or less about 1.7 Earths. We're using more than what the Earth can replace in one year in terms of resources. The scientists calculate what they call Earth Overshoot Day. It's that day in a year where we reach the point where we've used up what the Earth can replace in one year. Last year, 2018, that day was in, 20, in on the 1st of August already. Now, different societies use different numbers of resources. If everybody in the world used resources the way the Americans do, Earth Overshoot Day would have been on the 15th of March. South Africans, you may ask, if everybody used resources the way we do, that day would have been on the 25th of June. So we need to be smarter. Sustainable development goal number 12 deals with responsible consumption and production. And as futurist, I will be keeping my finger on the pulse of three emerging trends. The first one is our business models is adapting and changing. We're already seeing that strategic decision makers are thinking about the long-term environmental and social impact of the decisions and their strategies. The second thing I will be watching is the movements and changes in terms of single-use plastics and packaging. Across the globe, there was a massive outcry against the use of plastic straws and plastic bags, and that paved the way for the rethinking of single-use packaging across the board. Well, me personally, I think we have to rethink single-use everything. The third thing I will be looking at is where we start doing less. Where we do less clothing, less food, processed food that is, less traveling, buying less stuff, rather focusing on quality rather than quantity having lots and lots of stuff. So my challenge for 2019 to you is to be the responsible people that we could be and let's do less.